Hello guys, today I will show you how you can create this custom compass that is updating life and when you reach your area the compass has disappeared. The compass can be toggled on and off by a button but you can connect this to other devices so for example when you enter that area the compass will disappear forever. There is also the possibility to add multiple targets, so each time you log in, you have another area to explore. And today I will show you how you can make this. Let's go to UEFN. Hold up, let me stop you for 10 seconds and remind you that our new box PvP template is officially out, where you can create your own unique superpower box PvP in under 5 minutes. In this pack, there are 25 superpowers that will definitely impress your players. For more info, check out our Patreon linked down below. Now, let's get back to the tutorial. After creating a new project, go to here and make a new folder. Call this one UI. It's very important that you call this UI uh, because otherwise the code will not work. Now, if you open this folder, you need to drag in the assets from our Discord server and you can find the link in the description. These are the assets from our compass and each time the location is changing, the picture will change also. So that's how we create the live updating effect. Now we can go to the verse and we need to make two verse files. One will be compass manager. I will create an empty one. And one will be example manager. We'll open the compass manager. We copy the code from our Discord, like this. You can also type this code over. And now go to the example manager and paste the other code from our Discord server, like this. Here I have an array of some vectors, but actually we can delete this. Now we have one location. And here you can fill in your vectors. And then the X and the Y are very important. So you can simply change those by filling in your coordinates. Like this. If you want to have multiple places, you can simply copy this. And do it like this. Now we can fill in something else here. And basically now on the game start, the target location will be one of those. So you can make uh, like a, a list of a lot of vectors and then you can place there like hidden treasures and people can find them. And then every time they launch a new session, they will have another location or a chance to get another location. So that's very useful to know. Now we're gonna build the first code. We go to our content browser and we're gonna drag those devices inside our world. Here we can set this to compass device. We have an enable and a disable button. Here we have the options to change the position of the compass and the alignment. Um, th these values are between 0 and 1. So basically 0 0.5 is in the middle of your screen, 1 is on the right side, 0 is on the left side. Uh, you can change this to whatever you want, but on the example that I showed you, those were the values. So you can just copy those. Now here we have the size of the compass, you can change this to whatever you want. And here we have the distance to height compass. So basically, if you are far away from the area, so basically if you are far away from that area, uh, now it's set to 300 meters, so if you are 300 meters away from that area, your compass will be hidden. So that's maybe also a cool feature. 
if you want it to show every single time you can simply set it to 9000 or even a higher number and here you can set it to kilometers meters and centimeters like you see it's a very simple setup uh, let's say you want to change the button so the disable button into a mutator zone I'm gonna do that uh, with you so you can simply change that so we go to the example manager and now instead of using a disable button we're gonna add a new alt editable like this now we're gonna subscribe on that one so basically just type the name and then choose agent enterings event dot subscribe let's say enter you enter location place that function over here copy that one and also copy this part now we're gonna place the mutator zone inside our world I don't know the exact location now but let's say you, your location is here you can see the coordinates over here 2500 but if you change it to the exact location you have you can also copy those coordinates you need to build the first code again and we can enter that mutator zone to our game manager now basically if you enter this mutator zone your compass will be disabled forever so that's also a nice feature I hope you like it if you have any questions about the system Send us a DM on Discord. Have a nice day. Bye.